Mythic Rush? And then you can build like a Death Sans or some shit. Should travesty. The way you say our love should be. A little bit of Ziz music in our ears. Man on the rock. A little bit of man on the run in our ears. Better win this? I got you. What are they about Cleaver Rush? Cleaver Rush can work. Can. You can do Cleaver Rush as well. Like this game, for example, I could do Cleaver Rush if I wanted to. But the reason why I don't think I will is just so I have anti-heal for the channel and the Tarek. Good. Nice! Okay. Ooh. That's what I needed in my fucking day right now. A little bit of a fucking dopamine spike. Ooh. And now we have a little bit of till the sky falls down in our ears. My god! It's time. Fuck it. Sell potion? Give me the long sword. I want a bit of damage. Even Shroud is actually decent again? No? You can do Even Shroud as well. Would I recommend it? Eh. Thing is, Hecarim's more of a soul carry champ, so that's why you don't need Even Shroud. It's like nowadays, Hecarim can solo carry every game. It's not a joke when I say I could probably go on like a fresh account, right? Um, I can probably go on like a fresh account and get like a 95% rate to Masters if I was like giga tired every game with a duo. Hecarim right now is in the best solo carry state he has ever been in his entire life. The only one that is maybe arguably better was the initial... Uh, not even Chemtank Manamune was this strong, I'm gonna be honest with you. Maybe like the olden days of Hecarim Udyr meta with Chemtank and um... Chemtank with uh... like Deadmans. That's the only other one I could think. Because right now this is generally his strongest, if not second strongest, strongest state ever. Talon probably rumbling down. I feel like I probably do this for free. Fuck.
Perfect. Go. Just had to be a little patient there. That's all. Patience wins games. If they walk up like that again, I'm killing them both. I'm not going to tolerate that disrespect when I have ghost up. Ghost three Q stacks, my nah. Not tolerating that shit. I'll be waiting. There we go. I've been watching for so long now that I know some of the lyrics to your songs. I mean, it doesn't surprise me, bro. I'm going to be real with you when I say this. No bullshit. I think that if you were to play... It, like, people sometimes ask me, like, Hey, hey, Dantes, what's what's the song with the lyric that says this? And I can, like, find in the playlist which playlist it is. Like, the name of the song, it's crazy. So I do here is I get one Q stack, right? I got two Q stacks. If I can't boss come over, I'll just fucking go, son. I, I swear Trundle's an easy matchup nowadays. It's insane. Hecarim is a better fighter than Trundle is nowadays. He fucking stomps the matchup. It's crazy. Back in the day, Trundle would run you over and not anymore. I swear I would probably even win the Olaf matchup, I think. I would probably even win the Olaf or fucking Nocturne matchup. B both in the past unwinnable matchups. The only one who still stands a chance is Udyr. He's the only bad matchup Hecarim has in terms of, like brawlers, duelers, whatever. So I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna see that set is over pushed, but I want Q stacks for when I gank him. So I come here, I Q the Herald once, and now we go for the set. He backs off, that's fine. We just take Herald. It's like, is Trundle even good anymore? He can't be used as a counter pick versus Hecarim, that's for sure. Back in the day, he could. He would fucking run me over. What about the Yi matchup? I think he still wins. But I just perm on that shit. So it's like, I don't know. Good. Notice how I used W there for the 15 MR? Don't forget. Alright, so this game, since enemy team has a Tarek and I'm insanely fed, I think we just go full AD. So I can insta-kill their entire team. Versus Tarek, you have one of two options. One is you go full AD, so you insta-kill the champion. And the other one is you go, like, the chem tank build. And you play to, like, Ian with chem tank and, like, try to bait out his R and then re-engage when his R is down. But this game, just with the lead I have, like, I just want to fucking steamroll this shit. So we probably just go like Manmin into Eclipse here. Full Assassin. Hey Barsenak, name in the Prime. Welcome. Thank you. Notice how I'm keeping the Raptor alive? It's because my wolves still have like 7 seconds left. So I, now I can finish it with Q. And then I can run. And then we can take the wolves. See? And now I have two sacks for the wolf camp. Maybe we could try something mid. I mean, team is all here. I need Q socks off this wave. Okay, I'll just wait it out. Wait, I never used the E. Oh my god! 
If I would have actually pressed either I triple kill. Oh. I swear I did it, but it just didn't go. Fuck. Oh, I actually never pressed E. Wow. Oh, shit. Fuck. Not bad. Can you not actually take this game seriously now? Because it's usable. No more limit test. Now we take it serious. Not that I wasn't taking it serious, but now it's like no more limit test. See how I keep Q-Sacks for my Raptors to Wolves and now I just kill Cell with Q-Sacks? Again, the power of keeping Q-Sacks. You know what, maybe I'll actually go Death Sound in second. That sounds into some anime and then get a clip that's like fourth item. Could also be a good idea. So now I leave Scuttle alive. That way I can just run out Scuttle. Keep Q sacks and now we can invade bot side with Q sacks. <laughs> you guys see how like I'm telling you nobody can keep Q sacks better than I can. Good. Just this. So now the question is, why did Karma not just auto the turret twice? I'll never know the answer to that. But it's fine because I have that sound, so. Alright, so now I just see my enemy and we're okay. Q sack, dude, I'll tell you guys the funniest thing I ever read. I was watching a Tarzan stream, I think like two years ago, back when he was dating Jewel. And he was playing like Mario Kart with her, right? And at one point, he's there, and he looks so out of it. And then some guy in his chat comments, it's funny, <laughs> because he's there with his girlfriend playing games, but all he can think about is keeping e-stacks on graves from wolves to raptors. <laughs> he just looked so fucking out of it. Good. What? Good.
Toxic Cringe Chomp? Yeah, but it's okay. I could go for Herald here, but if I do, then I think I get to Dragon too late. So that's why I don't want to. See so again, queuing the wave to start my Q stacks. Yeah, so here we don't need to fight. We want to fight on Dragon. What's up, Serena? Come. Again, here, I'm not fucking around with my team. I'm getting q sacks on Dragon. Perfect. I could chase Han here, but if I do, I can't get Herald in time. So there, that's like forsaking emotion for like logic. You know what I mean? It's like guys who sit there and they're like, fuck getting a girlfriend. If I get a girlfriend, it means I can't play League 15 hours a day. It's like you forsake emotion for logic. And it's better. Nice. Now we reset, we get mad immune. Alrighty! Now you guys are about to start seeing a bit of damage. Now shit's gonna start going crazy. Oh. From flesh and bone. And then the seconds where we are. Alright. Oh, you just use your W. Aw. Cute. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Set! Where's your damage now, bitch? He tickled. Wow. Can we go Baron? Nah. We would have needed like Draven alive. I just got a girlfriend that one tricks you me? Yeah, but I can't do a Master Plus. So it's like she'd be good for like two days or some shit. And then it's like, what's the point? When there's nowhere left to run, run with me. One second, Marty. I'm about to go god mode. So I need to give me like one second here. But uh, salty, theme of the reset. I'll come back. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. This one's looking a little over. Am I Dantes or Doa now? The duality of man, demon, or god. I know what you mean. It's like I know what you mean. What if I told you it's like I don't even know what the answer to that question is? 
Guys, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm gonna build an item this game. You're gonna go fucking crazy. I'm gonna be honest. Type right now what item you think I'm gonna go that's gonna make you all go crazy. It's like there's only one item. There's only one. No other item would make you all go fucking crazy. And I've been getting asked about it for fucking months. So it's like this one time, I'll give you the item. It's like I'll give it to you for once. Prowler's Claw. Let's have a little bit of fun, shall we? It's like, let's see how this does now. Run with me. Not too shabby. Not too shabby for a little hacker game for us. <laughs> 